Well, this isn't awkward at all. Welcome to me talking to myself. The point of this is, it was proposed to me last night, which was the last day of 2014, that maybe I should do something like start a 365 day vlog where I learn a new dance every day and post it on the internet because I am limited to the one dance I do all the time, which goes something like this. To pretty much whatever music comes on at the time. So it could be like, slow jams, man. Like, slow jams, man. So I, I am a person that likes to stick to one thing and doesn't like to change and doesn't like to escape from my comfort zone. So I kind of laughed at it, but then started to think more seriously about it, and I was like, something like that could be really fun. So then it was like, well, 365 days is a lot of days to be posting and editing and filming and whatnot. So then it was like, well, why don't you do something once a week? You know, 52 videos. And um, that still sounded doable, but I wasn't quite sure about the, you know, 52 new dances. Um, not saying that I'm not gonna do any of that, but not 52 times. So what I really decided to do, and I mean, I know this is gonna take a lot of effort and a lot of timing and maybe a little bit of money and planning, but um, something I'm gonna call Project 52 because I'm not clever and there's 52 weeks in a year and it's a project. Every week, I am either going to try something new or do something that gets me out of my comfort zone, which, is pretty much mostly anything in the whole world because my comfort zone is about this big. Hence the the one dance. So yeah, there's already some things I know I'm going to be doing, like I'm in a musical. Um, that's definitely a stretch for me. I don't do many musicals and the last one I did was about six or seven years ago. Um, I don't have a running list of ideas yet, but in the back of my new 2015 planner, there is the oh so convenient notes section and I am reserving this section specifically for ideas for project 52. Um, some of these will be my ideas, some of them will be um, ideas that I'm going to ask you for in just a second. If anybody even watches this, I mean for all I know I could be doing it completely for myself and that's completely fine too. All that being said, this is what I'm doing in 2015 and this first week is shorter because I am going to do it on like a, a weekly thing and the new year started in the middle of a week. So what I'm going to do for the rest of this week is do um, kind of like a daily vlog mashup and pile it all into one week. So, or one, and pile it all into one vlog that gets posted like that. That's the motion. Project could be anything. It could be, you know, posting a weekly vlog. It could be um, trying out a new subscription box and showing you what comes inside of it. It could be, um, I just had something in my brain and it's gone. It could be volunteering with, um, some sort of, uh, words. It could be volunteering with a charity that I've never worked with before or, um, you know, doing a different activity like roller skating, I don't know, it could be anything. Um, wearing an outrageous lipstick color all day, I don't know, it could be anything. Um, if you have any ideas, please let me know. I'm on Facebook and Twitter and I have an email specifically for this project now. Um, hopefully I'm not making it into a bigger thing than it's gonna be. But I would definitely appreciate suggestions of 50, 50,032 50, million. I would appreciate suggestions of 52 things to do and I will write them down and decide which ones I like and which ones I'm like no because if you tell me to go hang out with a clown all day there's no way in Hades I'm ever going to say yes to that. There are things that I might consider that are kind of outrageous so help me out. That's the way Project 52 is going to work. So thanks for watching. If you have ideas please let me know and obviously you'll get an update at the end of this week with my first vlog. So that's all folks.